Hi guys, this is Michelle again and what you see now is my lasagna. I cooked this lasagna a week ago and I took video on it and today I'm going to upload it into my YouTube channel so that I can share it with you. But if you are still curious about how did I do it, then watch this video till the end guys. Then your curiosity will be answered. So first thing I do is I boiled water. I put a little bit of salt and I put a little bit of oil on it and then I put my pasta and I will cook it until it will become soft. The second thing I do is I will make the filling of my lasagna which is beef. First I have two medium onions. I use butter and olive oils to fry the net. Fry until golden brown. Then I mix my beef. My beef is um, one half kilo. As you can see, there still have water in it. But for me, I will leave the water at, until it will be completely dry. Anyway, the water will help the meat to become soft. Now that it's already completely dry, I can put my tomatoes. It's about two big tomatoes. Fill that. And then can mix my capsicum and my um, shredded carrot. I love to use carrot on my um, lasagna filling because it gives a um, little bit more sweetness on my uh, mixture. So now I can put my um, spices. First, I have one maji, a teaspoon of black pepper powder. And then I love to put oregano. It depends on you on how much you want it to put. So give it a stir. And then I also love to put uh, a teaspoon of cumin. And a teaspoon of salt. So give it a mix, mix it properly. Until well, well combined. And then you can cover it for about 10 minutes. So here we go. Now we can add our two tablespoons of tomato paste. Give it a stir. Then now we can put our blended tomato this is a tomato puree it's very nice to add into our lasagna filling it's it is very very nice smell i can i can assure you guys when you make it this at home your children and your family will love it so now this is it it's ready to use for me i love to be it's nice to a little put bit watery the pasta. i don't want it to be very dry yeah so just this is nice. good this is ready and now we can put our pyrex ready so to arrange our lasagna it looks like this first you have to put the filling this is my own arrangement only 
But if you want to make your own, it's okay also, no problem. Then we can uh, put next our um, sliced cheese. Guys, this sauce that I'm using is the sauce of bechamel. So if you want to know how did I make my bechamel sauce, you can see in my video guys, this is one video which is uh, beef bechamel that I made it. And then I make the sauce also. So this is the one. If you want to know how to make it, you just check on that uh, link. Check on that video on how did I make my uh, bechamel sauce. Then we can spread our mozzarella cheese. After that, we can now put our pasta. So, as you can see, the pasta is quite uh, big and it is soft already. So again guys, you just repeat the process which is I do in the, I mean, below. So the same thing until you will get the finish line. So guys, the last line on top is the um, filling.
So the last but not the least is the mozzarella cheese. So if you can put more, it's better. I like to have a lot of cheese on top. After putting the mozzarella cheese on top, we can then put it into the oven for 250 degrees for about uh, 45 minutes. So guys, this is my finished product and uh, I hope you like it and thanks uh, very much for being with me uh, while doing this video and um, please guys, uh, if you do like it, uh, please um, support my video, like, share and subscribe and then uh, thank you so much for those who have subscribed me and for those who have not subscribed yet, please, please, please uh, subscribe my YouTube channel. So, um, this is all for today guys, so thank you so much and until in my next video, see you and God bless and bye bye.